I won an all right guys you got DJ Squib here now I hope you're all doing okay you know with this coronavirus thingy um, you know I've not done many videos uh, recently because I've just not been in the right frame of mind with the coronavirus situation um, but last night I had a dream and of, it was quite a weird dream it was it felt quite quite real you know not sort of one of these weird dreams it was quite quite real um, anyway what it was I was driving around with Scott you know Scott Cuba um, and it, we was in an RS Escort Mark 1 <laughs> bombing around South End and we ended up going to you know like a big club and Anyway, everyone in the club was everybody I'd ever known. Um, you know, there was everybody there. You know, even people who are not into certain types of music. Everybody was there. Um, and it was based on, you know, when the this coronavirus ends, you know, we're going to have a party or something. You know, it's got to happen. Um, so, but it, it just felt so real, this dream. Now, for a long while, I've been wanting to do another Area 51. Some of you know us from doing Area 51 club events. Um, and they were fun, you know, it was hard work, but it was fun. Um, but what I'd like to do is, I'd like to put on some sort of a party once all this blows over to this virus. It could be six months, could be a year, could be longer. Um, but you know, like a community event, you know, like a daytime event, so, you know, parents and kids can get involved. Um, gonna need, you know, sort of companies to come forward, you know, to supply the hardware to get this going, you know. Um, DJ equipment, lighting, you know, a venue, um, stuff like that. It will be a charity event, you know. You know, we've all been hit hard by this, but some more than others, and it, feel, it just feels right to try and do something um, to, to try and help people a bit, um, you know, my my limited way, you know, I've, I've been trying to sort of work out how we're going to do this, you know, the logistics of it are quite, you know, massive, um, but I'd like companies to come forward um, if they can, you know, I know business has been really hit bad and what better way to kickstart businesses once this is all over and done with, you know, so if the companies can supply whatever they can supply, be it a venue, equipment, uh, whatever, bouncy castles for the kids, you know, that sort of thing. Um, you know, the companies, obviously, they'd have the banner in the club or whatever, just to say, you know, advertising their wares, you know. Um, but it would be so cool if everyone could pull together um, you know, even if it's very minor what they're doing, even if they're just going to help out, you know. Um, but again, you know, I know so many people, you know, in different communities, you know, some some of you may know I'm well into retro gaming, video gaming. So I've got people out there who've got, um, you know, arcade cabinets, you know, the, the old retro games. So there would be, you know, room for people like that to come in, bring their arcade cabinets, uh, you know, it doesn't matter what it is, retro gaming of any type, you know, you know, like some of the old clubs years ago, they used to go to the clubs and there'd be PlayStation 1s that you could play, you know, and then that'd be in, in like a chill out room. But yeah, something like that, arcade games and, um, you know, someone doing a barbecue, hot dogs, ice creams, you know, that sort of setup. Um, but so this dream ride, it, it, <laughs> I got up and I just thought I've got to make this video. Um, you know, it might be, you know, quite a big task to take one for, for me. Um, but if we could all pull together in some sort of way, even if I don't do it, it, this might give other people the idea to do something. You know, to kickstart business and just, you know, a party for people once this all blows over. So it could be a long while yet. Um, but you know I've been watching the news and it's it's depressing and I've actually stopped watching the news um, because it's it, it, it's it's doing me head in um, but you know this dream I'd like last night it was 
it felt so real. Uh, walking around the club, seeing all my friends, um, driving around in this car with Scott Cuba, it's, it, it's mental, you know. Um, and, you know, when I used to put my club nights on Area 51, um, it was fun, but it was hard work. But I've been wanting to do something like this for a long while. Um, but when my marriage broke up a little while back, um, I lost my decks and my mixer. Um, it was, it, let's just say it was lost. All right, that's, I'm not going into all the details. So I've not been able to do any DJing, even for personal jollies, you know, and, and at a time like this when, you know, we're all looking for something to do because we're isolating, you know, uh, I've not even been able to do a mix so I could put it out there, express myself, you know, entertain you people a little bit, um, give you something to think about other than this crap coronavirus. Um, you know, and I won't lie to you, you know, I'm quite an outgoing jolly person, but this is sort of, it's quite scary, um, you know, so, but I'm sort of, I'm putting it out there, please people, you know, get in touch with us, um, you know, it doesn't matter what you can supply, even if you just supply your, your hands to help, um, but this really is going out to sort of the businesses, the companies, the shops, local in South End, um, that can supply the hardware to kickstart this party once we can get it going. Um, what Ideally what I'd like to do is, you know, I'd like to have at least two different rooms in a club. One, one room with all the dance music and one room with reggae. Even if we could have three rooms, you know, dance, reggae and rock or something, something like that, you know. Um, but it would be so cool if we could do this. Uh, again, get the, the arcade guys with their cabinets to come in, another room, you know, just, I don't know, just something really cool. It would have to be a daytime event, you know, sort of probably start at 12 o'clock, um, you know, and you, you know, it would go on for quite a few hours, not the stupid 12 hours or anything like that, but just, just so we could all let her hair down once this all blows over. Um, you know, some sort of a charity event. I don't know, I've, I'm, it's just ideas at the minute. So this might just be enough to start off other people thinking about what we can do once this is over. Um, I know the rest of the world is in shit because of this. We're all in the same, we're all in the same basket with this. Um, but. You know, I jumped out of bed this morning and it was like, wow, that this dream was so vivid in my head that I had to do this. <laughs> I had to tell someone, um, you know, it, it, it is hard, you know, and I mean, um, you know, there's me and my son at the minute and I know other people have got other problems and stuff, but um, I think what makes it hard for me is I've not really had much get up and go lately because of this and other things, but you know, not going into all that. Um, and not being able to express myself with me DJ and with decks. You know, I've, I've got nothing. I've got an old set of decks, but they're knackered. They don't even, it doesn't, they don't play. <laughs> so I can't do nothing. I was thinking about buying another set of decks and mixer. Um, I mean, I had Pioneer, uh, what were they, 1200s or something like that before, and a Pioneer 800 mixer, and it was the best, you know, radio work I did, I mean, yeah, I'm not the, most people know about what I've done, and the, you know, the fun we had, um, and everyone's trying to do their bit on Facebook, and, and doing different things to keep people organised, you know, daily people are doing daily internets, you know, on YouTube, etc. Um, but, you know, just think about this, you know, it'd be good for everybody once this all blows over. Sorry if I'm repeating myself, but um, it'd be really cool. Um, and so I might even look into trying to get another set of decks, um, but it's a lot of money what I'm looking at getting. Um, 
But you know, this 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 just take one thing at a time. This we're in this for the you know, quite a while yet. This coronavirus um, lockdown, you know. So you know, it'd be just so cool when when this all blows over that we could get together in some fashion. I don't know how yet. Um, it, I know the logistics of it is quite mad. When I used to run my Area 51 club nights, you know, the, it was a it was a big uh, undertaking to do for me. Um, obviously, it was friends and family helping. Um, you know, it, it, I don't know. We will, and I know there's a lot of clubs shutting down and stuff like that. This is before this coronavirus, but um, I don't know. It, it'd be like kickstarting businesses again uh, in some fashion. Um, but yeah, so really. What we need is everyone to try and, I don't know, come up with some ideas, contact me. I'll leave email addresses and Facebook so you can contact us, uh, you know, in the descriptions on, on YouTube. Um, but you know, it, it doesn't matter what you've got to offer, just get in contact with us. Um, you know, it, you know I'm, I don't know how we're gonna do this just yet. I've got some experience with organising club nights. Even some of the local guys in South End, you know, the other DJs, get in contact with us. Um, you know, we, we can put something on what is good for everybody, you know, to be there on the day when this ever, if this ever happens. Um, you know, charity organisations, anyone, get in contact with us. And if, if I don't do this personally, let's get this going. Let's, you know, let's get something happening. Um, let's, basically what it is, is something to look forward to when this is all over and done with. And we can look back um, and, you know, it would just be good. It would be, and it's also, it would give all of us something to aim for, you know, other than the daily get up what do we do? You know, you can only do so much housework. <laughs> um, we can't go out really, can we? You know, unless it's the shops, medical or other, you know. Um, and things probably will get a little bit worse than what it is now, looking around the world. Um, but let's try and keep spirits high. Um, so you can contact me, emails or whatever. Um, just put this forward to people that you know, talk about this, pass this message on this video. Um, let's try and do something what's gonna be productive rather than counterproductive. Um, I want it to be a charity event so everyone can get involved. It doesn't matter how small what you're doing, your help is needed. Um, I'm gonna have a word with some of the guys I know, you know, some of the people who uh, I've bought equipment from from club uh, you know the, the DJ shops some of my mates are involved with uh, you know the retro arcade arcade cabinets let's put something on you know what we're all gonna you know really look forward to and then in years to come we can look back and go oh, you know that was brilliant what we did you know but anyway look we're not gonna carry on um, please get in contact with us um, you know and we can go from there. Anyway, cheers guys. Thanks for listening to me ramble. But so this dream I had was so real. It was, you know, driving about with Scott, you know, Scott Cuba, <laughs> Coca Cuba, you know, his club nights. Yeah. But there's so many people in South End what could get involved with. There's all the DJs, like anyone who's in bands, any anyone who can supply anything, you know, like the, the, the mobile food people, the anything, it doesn't matter what it is, please, you know, give me something to think about because I'm going crazy and I will try and get another set of decks if I can, um, just for my personal, because I've not mixed for ages and I'm so missing having a mix up, you know, all my clubby stuff, even me alternative stuff, um, you know, from when I was on the radio, you know, but anyway, look, I'm going to bugger off. Anyway, cheers for listening. Um, Live long and prosper, may the force be with you all. Cheers guys, see you soon.